before you today. I'm just not too sure he'll be pleased with my progress as a mystic. What are you talking about? You used the aboriginal ball form to great effect back in Venice. He'll be proud of you. Maybe, but I lost my temper and got in a fight with Octavio. To help me? I'm sure the guru is happy to see friends sticking up for each other. Head into this cave. It'll take you right up to it. Okay, Bentley. Caves ahoy! Murray, try throwing rocks to destroy those stalagmites. Of course, uh, Throwing guards will work too. hydraulic flow chart, the door ahead appears to be sealed shut. Then I'll just bash it in! What's the good of having fists if you can't smack steel doors with them? It's too thick, even for you. No, to get through, we'll have to overload the pressure in this piston. You want me to punch it? I could do that! Use your aboriginal ball form to bounce on top of the piston and smash it down! Build up enough hydraulic pressure, and the door is sure to open. Piston, beware! You're about to be bounced!
Another locked door. To open this one, you'll need to overload all three pistons at the same time. and I still took you piston chumps to school! Oh! Look at the size of that guy! He must be jacked up by that mask of Dark Earth the Guru was warning us about! Curious. It seems to make the wearer much larger. Probably more aggressive, too. I can take him! My righteous quest! To see the Guru won't be stopped by some big stupid freak in a mask! Even if you won, you'd have nowhere to go. The door through has an electric deadbolt. This whole area runs off the same circuit. Even the drills are linked up. Then I'll throw this clown into the drill! That might break the circuit. Give it a try. Keep it up! You did some damage! One drill down, two to go! Just one left! Holy cow! That mask can run! Why can't do that? Intriguing. Press on to the Guru. He'll have some answers. The door should be unlocked now that the drill circuit is broken. Open up! I have returned, my master! The black water now runs clear. I'd like to... I am asking... Oh, man. Yeah! I want to join back up with my friends, and, uh... We're hoping you'd come along, too? Bamaji? You'd love it in the gang. We have all kinds of fun. Miners, gyrocopters, and a mask of Dark Earth? Yeah, that's a lot to deal with. But we'll help you, I promise! Ooh-da-ha! Thanks, Guru. I'm happy to see you, too. Murray, let's motor out to Ayers Rock and scare away those mining dingoes. Your guru wants it purified. Awesome! This is the biggest truck I've ever gotten to drive! I could crush houses with this baby!
the miners out of Ayers Rock. But for my plan to work, we'll need to force the drill on this rig deeper into the ground. Okay, Bentley. You've got my interest. Though it looks like I may have to take care of a few guards if I'm going to get at those drill controls. Defeat the guards and start the drill. Then Murray can begin phase two of my plan. Nice work, Sly. The sonic vibrations caused by that drill should drive the giant scorpions in the area to the surface. If we can capture a bunch of red soldier scorpions, releasing them into Ayers Rock is sure to push out the miners. Sounds like a job for the Murray. One question, though. How do I capture scorpions with a truck? The vehicle is equipped with a supercharged e-brake, which, if pulled with moving, will cause a forward flip. Time it correctly, and you'll trap a scorpion in the mining that's built into the bed of the truck. Okay, Bentley. Bring on the scorpions. Not so fast. The truck's tires will heat up quickly in this blazing hot sand. You'll have to cool them down by driving into the water or running over scorpions. Watch your heat meter to make sure they don't melt. And remember, we're only interested in the red soldier scorpions. The blue worker scorpions won't help us scare the miners off. The truck controls are straightforward. Hold the X button to go forward and the square button is nice work. Looks like more are being driven to the surface. Okay, Bentley. I'm on my way.
truck full of scorpions up to the mine entrance and deliver that not-so-friendly payload. Now! Giant scorpions? Run for it, mates! Uh-oh! Nice teamwork, guys. Ayer's rock is clean of miners. The guru will be pleased. the stone. Murray has purified Ayer's rock, and now I humbly deliver your walking stick and moonstone. The time for escape has come. Ooh, da, da. Thank you, you're too kind. But tell me, how do you plan to escape? Over da, in da. Gadzooks! You can transform yourself. Why, once you change shape, a guard is sure to come inside and investigate! Hey, Baba Honda! Hi, Baba Honda! <laughs> Too true! Wait, here comes a guard! Faster! Hold down the L1 button to. What? Where'd he go? Faster, you're the greatest! That jump's totally fooled! Once his back is turned, use your powers to take over his mind. Oh, 
Luke's boss. Head for the drills. I guess Bentley's found a weak spot. Uh-huh, yeah. I hear you. Those drills are tearing up the landscape. They appear to be fragile at the base. Ram a guard into it, and the whole apparatus should break apart. Oh yeah, some things never change. I know, it's awful. However, the linked generator is weak, easily destroyed, provided you can jump a few guards over there and ram it. Ah, what a time.
the guru has agreed to join our team, provided we can rid his homeland of the dingo miners and deal with the mask of dark earth. A tall order, but we're up for it. First, we'll enlist the aid of some local wildlife to help thin out the miners' ranks. Murray will feed our foes to a local giant crocodile. With some luck, he'll take a liking to the taste of miners and chow down on them left and right. Second, we'll hit these guys where they live, or at least relax. If we can clear them out of this lemonade bar, it'll be a crippling blow to their morale. They'll be begging to go home. And finally, Sly will use some mining equipment to drill for radioactive oil deep beneath the dried lake bed. Trust me, it's the key to getting rid of the mask of dark earth.